All right, so now that we have this together here, there's a few bolts to tighten. There's this one on the top and these two in the front. These are the ones that secure it up and down and stop it from moving. This is the one that tightens tension. So we're gonna tighten this down to 60 foot pounds. Once that's at 60, we'll tighten these down to 60 foot pounds and then it'll be good. Tighten these evenly. You don't want to just creep down on one. All right. One thing to note: this truck comes equipped with the eyelet, the chain hooks that are already there. If you don't have those in your bed and you've just installed this BMW hitch, you need to use this little attachment. We're not going to use that. We don't need to. All right. When it comes to installing this, uh, what do they call it? King Ping Coupler, or whatever it's called. Um, you disregard the instructions that came with the Anderson hitch for a minute and go to the instructions that came with the chain bolts because you're going to take out these two bolts here and you're going to put in these eyelet screws here. Now, they don't want this eyelet close to that cable coming out. So that one goes that way. And that one goes that way. So you remove these, put these in their place. To do that, you loosen these four Allens. And that is a one quarter inch Allen. You can just get a longer one, like a three inch, so you totally clear this. And so we'll do that. We'll loosen these four Allens. We'll remove these bolts. We'll put the other ones back in uh, after we get it on the truck. All right, so we've got this on here and we're gonna get it lined up the way we want it. And then we're gonna tighten these to 40 foot pounds. There's four screws there. There's four Allens, two here and two there. We'll tighten those in. Then these, per the manual, just get snugged down. To me, snug means like, I don't know, snug means a lot of different things to different people. Snug to me could mean 100 foot pounds. So I'm guessing it means less than 40 because otherwise they'd give a number. So we'll make sure they're snug. It's got a lock washer. Um, but this is really what's holding your trailer on. So once this is clipped here, once the chains are clipped from here to down there, they can't loosen on their own because the chains hold them tight. So you don't have to worry about it backing out. It, it, it's not possible. Um, so really this is what's gonna hold it snug. And this is just the safety latch. So on this thing, if you've got a short bed pickup truck, which is, this is not, but if you have a short bed, spin it around the other way and have this coupler out front. If you have a long bed like I do, then you want this to be closer into the bed because you're farther away from your cab. You don't want it to be out over the back of your uh, axle. So put it in like this. The coupler will go here. The weight will be centered where it's supposed to be. be just in front of the axle. All right, on these screws here, you uh, snug them down once you get it straight. And then I measured from the edge here to here, and I made it the exact same all the way around. It's like four and seven sixteenths or close to that. And then uh, I would like you to do a car. I would tighten these across and just keep tightening them a little bit because they are making it flat level up here because they're just the set screws that screw into that that stops any of this from moving so you want them all to be equal like it said in the manual just hand tight the OCD part of me wants these to be completely flat but it says in there if you tighten them tighter than hand tight they will crack this plastic so you know I want to go tighter but I'm not going to these pins themselves are extremely tight because they're held in by the friction from these other pins here. So nothing's going anywhere. All right, now we're gonna take this uh, coupler release and 
we're gonna screw it on here. One thing I don't want is this this thing buffeting against here and making a mark. So do it in a way that hopefully that it doesn't touch. 